Looking at the front door, we've got a nice size little yard. There is tons of parking. There is a covered area. This is for the entire downstairs. The upstairs unit has its own parking and is completely separate in every way. Let me take a walk inside the house here and walk into a big open living room. I'm taking this video right now before I've had a chance to paint. Uh, looking into the bedroom number one here. Um, lots of light everywhere in this unit. Big windows. Closet over here. Tall ceilings. Uh, back into the living room area. We've got a coat closet right here. Um, lots of places uh, hang your coats and storage right inside the front door. Like I said, it's a really good size living room. And over here, we've got the bathroom that we're going to walk into. It's a full-size bath with a shower, stand-up shower only, no tub. You can see some of my paint touch-ups everywhere. It's going to be all completed here shortly. Walking into the kitchen, we've got a lot of counter space, tons of storage everywhere, cabinets all the way around, full floor to ceiling, cabinet, pantry, stove and refrigerator. Got a utility room with hookups for washer dryer, which is pretty great. Uh, you provide your own washer dryer. And then walking into, we've got bedroom number two. This is a narrow bedroom, so it's not a it's not a huge bedroom. This is more kids' room or an office. It's probably my favorite part about this house is there's lots of outdoor storage. I wouldn't call this a garage. It doesn't have a garage door, but put a lawnmower, a motorcycle, tools, whatnot in there. You've got a big covered area for two cars, and there's there's even more. Uh, parking available as well all the way around the unit but uh, two undercover spots and a uh, big storage area inside this little garage and a cool little uh, uh, call it like a back patio uh, it's nice and secluded have a barbecue undercover it is Washington 